that enough, do you think? Yeah, that ought to be able to fend that. Do you want the pollen patty? Uh, I think just lay it on top of the sugar. So this was one of our really strong hives and we came out today and realized there were no bees flying in and out. So we opened it up and it looks like they swarmed on us. So what we have left is a little ball of bees about that big. <laughs> so we moved them from the big hive back into the swarm box. We're feeding them uh, two quart jars of sugar syrup and a half a pollen patty and we're going to hope that they're going to be okay. <laughs> Um, so we're going to come back into this colony in a couple of weeks. Uh, we did add some uh, sugar syrup and uh, pollen patty to help to feed them. Uh, when we went in earlier this afternoon, we did find the queen. Uh, she was really small, but we did see a queen and again a little handful of bees. Um, so it looks like that's what's left after the swarm. There were not very many resources. There was a little spot of nectar about this big and, I don't know, maybe a dozen uh, cells that had some pollen in it. So, um, looks like the either the colony cleaned everything out when they swarmed or it's been robbed out since they left. I'm not really sure which. But we've reduced the entrance down uh, so there's not very much for them to defend. We've reduced the um, frames down to only three frames. And uh, so again, we're going to check them in a couple of weeks and see how they're doing. If we see brood then, we'll know that the queen has started laying and uh, hopefully they'll, they'll recover. If not, if there's no brood when we come back in, then we'll probably dispatch the queen and combine these bees with another colony. So here's hoping.